Well, the new winners are in the studio fresh off of a huge weekend. You know, on Friday, if you were watching the show, we introduced you to last year's winners for the Miss South Carolina Teen Volunteer. And we're saying the pageant is this weekend, and here they are. Let's give a big congratulations <laughs> to 2024 Miss South Carolina Teen Volunteer, Gracie Arnold, and the 2024 Miss South Carolina Volunteer, Berkeley Bryant. Yo, I said, I really appreciate you coming on the show Monday morning after having been done all Absolutely. weekend. No. And just put on all the makeup and dresses one yes. more time. No place we'd rather be. So, so excited. We're thrilled. Yes. Thank well, you Tell us about the pageant for, you know, any of those that didn't get to make it. Yes. So we had Miss South Carolina volunteer this past weekend in Spartanburg, South Carolina, thanks to One Spartanburg. So we had an outstanding weekend. We had 25 outstanding contestants with us. And we were so lucky yes. to be able to walk away as the representatives for our state so we're really excited so what's next so we'll start with you what what's what's after you being your Carolina debut and then what yes yeah, so I have nationals in Jackson Tennessee in March and I'm super excited Yay. it's gonna be here before we know it yes 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 it's like okay good I have a chance to rest okay yeah. no, oh, no we do not <laughs> yes so both of us will represent South Carolina at the national level her at Miss Teen Volunteer America me at Miss Volunteer America in Jackson Tennessee this is a Tennessee-based scholarship program that strives to empower women and we are so excited to be a part of this new brand and again the mission is to empower young women to believe in themselves and believe in their dreams one of my personal goals is to be a trailblazer for young women to believe in those dreams yeah. and really just stri strive to see those goals to actualization so, I love that yeah. what will your you know kind of platform be yes yeah, so my platform is called angel kisses and when I was a little girl I have a ton of freckles and we call them angel kisses too. yes that's like, oh, that's that's your beautiful me. angel kiss right there. Yes. yes, so I would come home crying. My mom would tell me I was kissed by thousands of angels. Aww. And so once I got a little older, I started going into kindergartens and elementary schools and just teaching them about kindness and yes. instilling it at a young age because 50% of younger children actually remember what they're taught when they're older. So it's so important to start at a young age. And that's so true. You think, oh, it's just kids being kids. It's like, yeah, but one thing a six-year-old yes. said to you. Once they reach middle matters. school, I mean, I still remember being picked on about my freckles. And oh my gosh, right. and freckles are so pretty. Like, right? Anyone that does <laughs> right. freckles, they like, oh my gosh, I wish I had freckles. And <laughs> speaking of differences, so my personal platform is set the pace for inclusion, hashtag stronger together. And honestly, they go hand in so hand. So much together, yes. Yes. Because those differences are really what define us and, and the reason I say stronger together is because the more we can talk about our differences the more we can realize that that diversity is really what is going to make us stronger as a community and as a culture and I think the culture of the Miss Volunteer yes. America program does just that we celebrate diversity we celebrate differences and we're so excited to be representatives of such an organization like that well Absolutely. they definitely got some amazing women and I think that is so true because sometimes you can have a group of people and you can be like we're so different like how are we getting on and then just start right. talking and you're like wait you think that too or that everyone has to a you? strength oh my gosh yes. like it all just Listen, you know, you'll yes. be surprised. Yes, the more you listen, I love that you said that because yes. there's such a huge value in listening to one another and mm -hmm. listening to each other's stories. There's so much we can learn from one another. And the, the more we do that, the better we're off we're going to be. Well, so. I love it. So next up for y'all, March Nationals in Jackson. And then mine is in June. So we have Teen Volunteer okay. in March. And then we have Miss Volunteer America in June of 2024. So be on the lookout. We are super excited to represent represent the Palmetto State on the big stage. Please yes. keep us posted because y'all are fantastic and thank y'all for coming by again. So thank you so much for having us. You got it, you got it y'all.